Previously on Minecraft Survivor, the Pantanal. Logan to the tribe was trying to regroup as one after tribal council. The outcasts continued to bond, while Derek on Arandu stumbled across the idol, securing it for himself. At the challenge, it was revealed to be a swap, which shook up the game. Three tribes became two, and NKS was sent to exile, where he found the outcasting rod. Only one immunity was up for grabs, and the Bokutu tribe pulled off the win, sending Arandu to their first tribal council. Back at camp, Lunar and Alec figured their position on the tribe, as the outcasts had the majority. Derek was all alone, and was hoping to survive without using his idol. In the end, it was Mystic who shifted the tide, sending Lunar home in a 3-2-1 vote. How will the votes unfold tonight? Tune in to find out now on Minecraft Survivor, The Pantanal. So, Lunar just got voted out. Can't say I'm too surprised. There was a little blind side to it. I'm upset, but I'm glad that it wasn't me. A 3-2-1 split on a six-person tribe is not the best. Of course, I would have rather had Derek go home over Lunar because I knew I could trust Lunar, but now it's a tribe of four versus Derek and I, and it's a bunch of sharks, and they're gonna decide who they want to go. Oh, you're right. Yeah. Here, I'm gonna... Hey, I've got, hey I've chickens got the are on the loose. The chickens are on the loose. Quick, control the uprising. <laughs> I, feel so, I feel so bad. We raided their camp and now chickens are just flying out of the pen. So I chose not to show my idol. My, I was going to show the tribe that I can be trusted by showing them and then maybe giving them advice on where the other one is. But I chose not to. I, I had faith in the people that I thought I had faith with. And it turns out I was, in fact, right. I was not being voted out. I was narrow. I took the risk, and I got it. But I was the only vote for Corellium. And Lunar had told me that Alec was the other person who said he was really going to give it a shot. And he didn't. So I don't trust Alec anymore. We were terrified. Because Derek basically said to me, as the round like kind of ended, that he really implied that he had the idol, so... Yeah, um, yeah. I'm surprised he didn't play it. I'm surprised he didn't either. We pulled it off. We pulled off the blind side on Lunar. Uh, I did not want that. I, I really did want Derek to go, but I was also fine with Lunar. I didn't have a conversation with Lunar, so I was okay with just voting them out. The real thing I'm worried about is Alec. I really said, I trust you. Uh, I think I'm going to be voting Derek. I'm really going to pray that he still wants to work with me he has no reason to however and i am very very much worried for derek linking back with green tribe and so right now i would still get rid of derek and i will get rid of derek if it comes to that well, farewell combledon i hate to see one go the chicken feed grows up so fast. Oh my god, I am so, so relieved. I, I really thought that there was all the potential for that to go to rocks, in which case, you know, there's there so many ways that could have gone wrong. But, you know, Mystic and Hades, they're, they're the guys. They 
not only do they stick with me, they manage to clearly get the others, the other guys, to just target themselves. Managed, and I just managed to slip on through. Yeah, I made a cake earlier. That's pretty cool. You, you think we could? You think? Uh, what, what's the, what are the ingredients for pumpkin pie? I make a cake. Oh, we can we can make some pumpkin pie. I'm so great. I'm so good at the game. What's up, everybody? It's Mystic. I'm back at it again, dude. My plan worked. I told my boys to vote Lunar out. Lunar went. No idol was played, meaning that our boy Derek does not have the idol, which is great news. So what that means is Derek will either A, have a vendetta against me, or B, be thankful that uh, that I uh, helped him. Survivor and the Pantanal are both known for snakes. Every challenge in this game contains high stakes. Some vote-offs may seem contradictory. A fishing rod could be the key to victory. It sounds like a fishing cop, guys. Like sounds fishing. Like chickens. Sounds fishing. Chickens. Sounds what fishy is, to me. What do they mean by snakes? Is this a game of, like, temptation or something? Well, I'm pleased to see that none of my OG outcasts got themselves voted off. When I heard that first vote, Coraline, I was like, Oh god, why did you do this time? But, uh, nope, they, they locked together, they 3 2 one out uh, Lunar, which, uh, decent decision, I, I, I guess they made some deal with Alec and they didn't want to do Derek, so Lunar had to go. Um, I've personally pissed off nobody in the game so far, so I'm perfectly okay with riding the merge. I'm just, I can't wait, I don't know who Jones is gonna say. Oh, uh, good. Me, but oof. I I'll be falling surprised who goes out. Cause I hope it's not Derek. That's my opinion. I think, I Only think because it, he's on our own. I think it could be Derek though, is because um because we never been um, when we, when we original tribes we never been to tribal council. So the fact that Derek's there, I'm more worried that he's gone. I I'm worried that he's gone. And also the fact that he has nobody else from his tribe there. Yeah, it's been yeah all the four of us end up being on this tribe so it's like all mama over there so we want another challenge i have yet to see a tribal council knock on wood um but i think we kind of killed it as a team especially as a new team you know just you know coming from the tribe swap um our team worked really well with planning and i've seen that as a trend the last few times that we've won as well oh you speak farsi yeah that's fab like i'm sorry that's fab to me you're bilingual like what? I'll teach you Farsi. I could teach us something. Okay, so Salam is hello. Salam. It's kind of like Arabic. Yeah, it's it comes from Salam Alaikum, but yeah, just shorten it. Everybody seems really cool. Um, I have like no issues with anybody, which is super rare within tribes, and it's nice to have a girl around or two now because um, you know my last tribe wasn't like that. It was all guys. I like that. Are you from Iran or are you just like... No, I had to learn it for the military. Wait, so you just learned Iran- like, or you learned Farsi you just- I was told to, so I did. How long did that take? Uh, they give you a year to be fluent. Damn! Oh, what? Yeah, yeah. it was the most stressful thing I've done. <laughs> Wait, you're like a fucking soldier, girl. You are the soldier, honey. Oh my god, thank you. Serving in multiple ways. Nadia's, you know, she's- and even Drew knows this, she's a little bit- a little bit odd she's like she's you know she's snobby and stuff she wants to know all the information which is not gonna happen but too she like she wants to she wants to have fun like not saying the game of survivor can't be fun but like we aren't here like i said we're not here to build houses i'm not here to build houses i'm here to win 100 dollars. i'm here to win the game oh my, oh my god we can add starbucks to my ihop order with no added delivery fees Nice. I'm gonna grab more Diet Coke, so I'll be back. They must be right next to each other or something. Oh, hi, Drew. <laughs> You're just sitting down here, aren't you? <laughs> yeah. During the swap, I was super happy or like, cool. Majority. Easy 42. But honestly, if I had to vote someone out right now, it would probably be Robster. I think he probably has the idol um, from the old Arandu tribe. If. It comes to a tribal, we'll sell the majority if we vote him out. So that might be my my goal right now. Y'all are scrambling off, don't oh, man. Thank that it. So we won this tribe challenge. It feels so 
great. Like we really played this out so well. And I won this the first round for us. Like I was able to get last person on that. So right now, my streak right now, I haven't been to Tribal Council not even once yet. So hopefully I keep my streak up. Like, are you close with Liv? I mean, I guess. Like, she, we all voted together at our first tribal, so, like, I owe her, you know? Like, I'm not going to vote her out if we go to tribal on this one. You know? Okay, like, because, I'm like, because, like, of course, like, my tribe, we made, like, a, uh, like, a, a pact, like, yo, we would never vote each other out. We keep each other all the way to final five. But, like, I'm not really about that life. You know are what I'm saying? Are you serious? But yeah. when I joined, Nadia said that y'all weren't doing that and that you guys barely talk. That's the thing. It's like we only talked as a group. Okay, but then it doesn't mean shit. That pack doesn't mean shit. Like what? exactly, exactly, and that's why I don't want to stick to that pact. You know, I just had a conversation with Lola, and it was a fantastic conversation. I told Lola practically that I am willing to flip onto her and Liv's side, as you know, Liv and Lola were on the original Orange Tribe, and of course, my, me, myself, Robert, and Drew were on the original Green Side, Green Tribe. There's a four to two in favor of the OG Green Tribe, but I'm willing to make things interesting and go three to three, you know, have some fun. Real talk, I, I of course, like, I think I have all four, four of them. Like, I have all four of their numbers because I was the team captain and stuff, but like, definitely I would, if we like say we lose the next comp, I'm 100% willing to like, I'll go with you and live. I'll go with you and live. And then we can, yeah. and we can split split that that connection up. J.K. Jake, whatever his name is, just pulled me into a call. He was like, "I need to talk to you." Blah blah blah. So we just went privately to talk together, like by the camp. And he really wants to work with me. Like he's kind of a little sneaky player. He's like, "I have all my old tribe in my pocket. Like I'm willing to work with you and Liz." And this is amazing. Like, of course, this is exactly what I want. I will say the only person who I am close with on like on my tribe was Derek, who is now on the other tribe, and Drew. Mm -hmm. I'm I'm close with them too. We we talked a little bit. Um, like we kind of well, leave. Liv, like I really think Liv would. If I told her that you guys wanted to like get with us, like I think she would because yeah. we feel like what the fuck are we gonna do? But look, I'm trying to get their connections because I would be set with these two who, you know, I want to be set with. And so I purposely start shit talking Nadia and Robster. Look, Robster, I kind of want him gone. You know, he's terrible at challenges and whatnot. And Nadia, like from the past OG Arandu tribe, like all she did was build that stupid house. And like I've said many times before, I I'm not here to build houses and, you know, dress up and have fun. I'm here to win the fucking game. And that does not require building houses. So I'm coming to Lola here and, you know, just shit talking them, making sure that she sides with me over anybody else, that I was the first one to talk to her, first one to gain her trust. And then if I want to make a, a blind side later in, she'll be willing to work with me rather than to work with anybody else. I don't know why I told Robert that I voted for him. I probably shouldn't have done that. I just felt like he should know. Yeah, he's a, like, uh, he's, he's, he's a different, different. He's very guy. like, yeah, I don't know. All these he, different voice acting, different personalities. Like he kind of gives me the heebie-jeebies. Like, I don't know. What he's like very, I he's like know. strict, straight to the point. Like, uh, like so like serious and like literal. It's. And it's, but it's like, it's but weird. I kind of like that though. I, yeah, I like it, but like, he's kind of a weird, weird person. You know, <laughs> I mess, I, I mess with him. Like, if Robert ever sees this, like, I mess with you, Robert, but like, you know. Not too much on Robert. Okay, like, he seems really nice. But if y'all have a pact, like, that's not going to work. I'm just going to use that and just kind of hopefully we can work together. I mean, he was the only person that really spoke to me so far. And he seems to really not like Nadia, like, he, and, um, Robert. Like, he was talking shit about them. It's just interesting. Like, I thought everything was perfect at their tribe. Nadia made it seem like, oh, we're all best friends. We cook in a fucking microwave. Like, what the hell is a microwave? Like, how can you have a microwave in the jungle? It doesn't even make sense anyway. Like, 
That was the just they got on my nerves. I'm I'm blessed where I'm in the position where I can able I'm able to where I can go with you and live and but also be able to stay with them so it looks I mean I'm playing the middle here, you know what I'm saying? But you think you're special. I am special. Interesting. I very that. I'm gonna, I'm gonna drop by the main call. Okay. I don't trust him one bit. And we're gonna have to see how things progress because it's literally every day something can change. Like if Jake starts pissing me off, I might tell Nadia that he talks shit about her. But if Jake it seems like a good ally that I wanna keep, I'm not telling Nadia shit. I'll tell Liv though. I'm gonna tell Liv because that's my sister. I feel like us getting swapped together it bonded us even closer. You know, I really need to talk to her one on one. What did I miss? I'm sorry, I was gone so long. Jake wanted to talk and then... What's it called? I had to take my dog out and then that guy wanted to do a confessional too. I'm like... Yeah. This is I'm too like, much. I want to obviously... I want to stick with Lola just because like that's my girl. And I feel like their alliance... Alliance in quotes is not really that strong just because they didn't really go to tribal together. So like they don't really have these like permanent bonds because they voted together or whatever. So I'm hoping... We can at least get like Nadia because like she's a fellow girl and like hey, like can you be besties? Survivor and the Pantanal are both known for snakes. Every uh -oh. challenge in this game contains high stakes. Some vote offs may seem contradictory. A fishing rod could be the key to victory. Oh. Oh, it's a dra something. I'm We're dragging not good something. at these. My my pregame strat was to take a back seat up until merge. However, if unless I'm being played, I feel like I'm in a pretty good spot right now. Um, I kind of had Derek and Robster um, as us kind of a three, and then I had Jake and Nadia kind of as a three. So it's kind of in the middle on the old tribe. And then we get to this tribe, super good with the swap. But I feel like since I have that three of Nadia and uh, Jake, I might want to step aside from Robster and just try to really form that bond with the other two. Welcome to getting your first look at the new Arandu tribe. Lunar voted out at the last tribal council. Oh, no. And Chaos has joined them. Oh, wow. All right, Pokatu, can I get back the immunity? Come place it down, Robster. Right here? Right there, thank you. Perfect. You're welcome. All right, let's get into it. For today's challenge, the tribes will be split into fishers and runners. The runners will run around the bottom of the challenge. The fishers will be stationed above with the sole purpose of launching the opposing tribe runners. After a few launches, the runners will die. First tribe to successfully hook and launch the other tribe members to death wins immunity. All right, yeah. the survivors ready? Go. Okay, we're all being so silent. Dude, they're hard to get. We're all so concentrated. Oh, wrong, wrong, not happening, wrong, nope, nope, wrong. I'm gonna make a run for the middle. Nice, oh, nice, got nice. Him. Dang it, dang it, I almost got him. Stop targeting me, that's make wrong. Sure, get the one, I can't see his name, but the one down. Watch it, Jake, watch no, it. Damn it, how'd that not get him? Wrong, what hell, what? get out Are of here. Are you serious? What, that hit? Hello, right? Right, right here, near the gate, near the gate. The fisher, fishing riders stay up the longest, oh. and people can fall. Oh no. Oh, get Robster, get Robster, he fell. Robster is still alive. He has to come out yeah, and come back in. Robster got coach. Oh! He's missing. Go, go, go. Uh, juice camping again. Running back up. Let's go. Oh, got him. I got Jake. I got Jake. Alright, be easy, be easy. <laughs> be easy. He's, just, he's baiting. Hold on, hold on. Let me try and get a, let me try and get a stick on him. No, no, someone, no. Someone up. Drew's, uh, Drew's camping under the under where I'm standing. All right, I got him stuck too. You want to pull? Hey, you Already, Jake. Yeah. Right. You no, pull, and I'll pull. Oh. Oh, hey, nice. you got, oh, he's a smart I mean, man. Yeah, nice, nice, nice. Yeah. There we go. There we go. That was something. Kick flip. Kick flip. What a rush! I skipped oh, one fifteen. Ah. Oh fuck! I got hit. I should probably stop. You're right, I guess. Oh, oh, one eighty. He's, he's, so he's so cooked. He's so cooked. Kick flip. Dive. <laughs> 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 Uh, 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 
That's crazy. Nice okay. throw. Good shot. Good shot. Uh -oh. Yikes. <laughs> I'm eating smackle. Yeah. What are you gonna do? What are you gonna do? Where are you gonna throw? Yeah, Where are you gonna throw? Oh, oh, Speckles. Ski well. <laughs> this thing falls like a feather. My god. Pull me up. Fuck! Okay, I need to stop fucking around. Drew's camping again. Oh my god, the fucking spectators! Derek's oh, running. Oh my god, Jake, please. Just... No spectators. Come on, get Drew. <laughs> I've gotten Drew. Uh -uh. Uh -uh. Trying to get him. We're trying. Uh -uh. We're trying. Drew, Drew's trying to get him. Oh, oh, yeah. 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 I know, just everyone, one of everyone, one of them. Just spread out. Just fucking corner. This is not spreading out. The military, right? This is like a firing squad. I'm like, Drew making a run for it. Yeah, they're, they're, they're running. Bad idea, bad idea. Yeah, just be careful, guys. Don't fall. Hey, everybody, hey, everybody. Look over here, look over here. Not you thought, not you thought, uh -huh, you thought again. Uh -huh. oh, nice, 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 my Who the hell fished me? No, you're good, you're good. Oh, they keep fishing people on accident. You're no, you're good, you're good. Come on, you slippery fuck! Just let us kill you! This is the slipperiest lad I've ever met. <laughs> God, I'm oh, good. good. You're not a, you're oh, hey, hey, hey. Oh, you died? Yeah. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. I got him. I got him. Yeah! 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 Congratulations! After a tough loss last week, you finally pulled it off. Someone come collect immunity. Yeah, you get a pussy. Uh, As the <laughs> runner, I yeah. think I need a dab up. As for the Poketu tribe, unfortunately, your win last week was the only one that you've gotten so far because now you're on the tribal council after this tough loss. Head back to camp. So we lost today's immunity challenge. It kind of sucked, but. Now this is the app, but now with tribal council on the way, this is where the game starts to happen. I want to keep the force strong. The plan is we're staying tribe strong. Okay. And we're voting Lola. Yeah, because I know she did vote for me at the first impressions thing. Who knows what would have oh, happened yeah. to say like, say we vote someone out right on the spot, and she did put my name down. Exactly. So I don't know because I haven't talked talk game with her a lot than than uh, Liv. Liv is someone who I've been talking a lot, and that's good for Liv. I just don't know about Lola. So that loss was kind of unfortunate, but the good side is we got me, we got Jake, we got Roster, we got Nadia, all four together. Um, so I'm not too worried for this vote. Uh, I feel like uh, I don't have any fear for idols yet. Um, us four can pretty easily work together here and take one of the girls out. Um, and if that plan doesn't work and I get blindsided, that is really unfortunate for me. So I think it'll be good to have numbers with Liv and Alec if we make the merge. So that way we can knock the original policy out. Yeah. No, I agree. Because it's, it's important because if we get Liv and Alec um on our side they realize that they realize that they're they're in trouble and we need to we need to have them as a number i've been talking more game with Liv than lola so i'm really thinking it's best move for my game to get lola out because she did vote for me for first impressions who knows what would have happened to say it would have been like uh like a vote out jk when he asked me to join a private call like a while ago Mm -hmm. He said that he didn't like Nadia. He said he didn't like the other one, the loud one. What's his name? Robert. Robert. Okay. And he said he wanted to work with us because he was like, are you close with Liv? And I was like, absolutely. Like, I'm not going to vote Liv out. Mm -hmm. And he was like, okay, well, I'll work with you guys. Because okay. um, he said that they all made a pact to like stay together with their tribe, but he doesn't want to do that. Like, 
I just got done talking with my sister Liv and honestly, I'm kind of nervous about tonight. I mean, obviously just based on our tribe, there's four from the green tribe and just me and Liv out by ourselves. So it's not looking in our favor, but I did talk to Jake before the challenge and we had a good conversation. And he pretty much said that he is totally willing to work with us and that he doesn't really trust the other three. So I'm kind of thinking like that could be a way for me and Liv to kind of, I don't know, work something out. Maybe we could somehow survive and get through to the next challenge. Um, but I definitely have to talk with Jake again and maybe Nadia because I really like her and I just want to see like if she's maybe willing to work with us. Maybe I told Liv that you wanted, you, we spoke before. And... Yeah, 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 definitely. Um, okay, because like I don't want to just us get targeted just because we're like on the other tribe type shit. Because like I know yeah. people are probably like you know like let's stay loyal, whatever. But like yeah, at the same time it's kind of like I don't know. You know what I'm no, yeah, definitely. Um, I I don't want to stay tribe strong, really and truly. So I was talking to Lola at first, and we were kind of scared that like our tribe is literally made up of four people from the same original tribe. But then I talked to, um, what was the name, Jake and Lola, like, together, and, like, apparently they had talked about, like, he didn't really want to stay loyal like that, so we just kind of went through, like, the other people, and we kind of came to a decision, like, we're gonna vote out Robert. Look, so there's the three of us, right? It's a three-on-three three right now? Mm -hmm. I think we can make this unanimous. Hold on. What do you mean it's a three-on-three? It's a three on three. It's me, you, Lola, me, you, Liv, and then Robert, uh, Nadia, and Drew. But um, what do you know? What did, did they say something? No, they're, they're saying a private call. I'm saying like if if like, cause I don't think they're gonna flip on each other. You know what yeah. I'm saying? They yeah. better. Let me talk to Nadia, girl. Hold on, hold on, though. Hold on, though. So but, like, who do we want to target instead of like us two? I think I think we go for Rob. Okay, that's like Loki what I was thinking. Well, we all know the big thing about tribe unity here. But I'm trying to spice things up, you know. It's boring just like pagonging a tribe. Here, we have the numbers four to two. But I'm not trying to do that. That's not me. i I'm an interesting player. So look, I'm gonna get Nadia and Drew on board to put a little blind side. You know, we're going to stab somebody in the back today. Uh, I got the girls with me. You know, the girls, myself, and everyone else, Drew and Nadia, we're going to vote Robster here. If I can push out this play, then this is setting me up long term because I'm getting the girls' trust because they're thinking, yo, Roger's going to get absolutely cooked by the OG Rondu tribe. But no, I'm saving them. And Robster, I'm sorry, man. You know, Robster, I love you, uh, but, you know, when it comes to competitions, you're not the best. So, are we, are we sticking with the four? I've, I've been talking to Jake a little bit. Yeah. Uh, he seems cool with, uh, I think he kind of wants us three uh, the most. I haven't talked to Robster that much. Yeah. Obviously. I've I think I've talked to more. Robert honestly less than I've talked to some of the girls. I agree. Um, Not that I have a thing against Robert or anything, but I've talked yeah, to I know. him the least. Okay. So, allegedly, we decided to vote Robert. Um, as much as I would have liked to have kept the old tribe together, um, I can't... The only reason for not voting somebody out can't be that we were in a tribe together before. I don't really vibe with Robert. There's nothing wrong with him or anything. Like, we haven't had any issues. I just, we haven't really talked a whole lot. Me and Jake were also kind of scared that he found the idol at our old camp. Yeah, he was um, looking for it pretty heavy. So, I'm okay with going that route. But if we want to stay us four strong, I'm also fine with that. I... And this is gonna sound bad. I have no loyalty to the the old tribe. I mean, like obviously I do, because I'm like chill with you guys. 
Yeah. I just mean like like the that's not going to be the reason that I keep somebody. Yeah, Does yeah, no, I, I completely agree. After a little bit of scrambling, a little bit of deceiving, we have a plan in play. Um, it's looking like we're going to try and get Robster out here, but there is the problem that he might have an idol. Um, I never found it at my original tribe, so I don't think Jake has it. I don't think Nadia has it. I think they would have told me, so there is a possibility for Robster to have it. So I need to go talk to him and make sure he's not going to play it so we can pull off a little blind side tonight. So what are you, what are you guys thinking? Uh, I think... What are, wait, is, what are you thinking, first of all? We, me and Jake are still trying to figure out who to, who to do, because we want to keep the four, four original, four okay. strong. Yeah. Yeah, we were thinking the same thing. Yeah. So who, who did we, we were talking about this, who we think could be helpful in the next challenge? Because we got, we got to think about what could be useful. I don't know, neither of them have been not useful. So we lost the challenge, it's fine. But I do want to keep the original four strong. Drew and I have a strong bond, and I know we want to keep a, keep our number strong. I want to convince Nadia to say we need to keep these alliance force strong to secure ourselves moving forward. And yes, I know Liv and Lola are nice people, but unfortunately, if you want to further yourself in the game, you gotta have like a decent goal. And unfortunately, I see Lola as more of a weaker threat. I get it that she voted for me at the very beginning, but you got to remember the how the votes went out from the start. You never know in case your name ends up being brought up. So it's important for us to keep the four original four strong moving forward. Who do you guys think? Like I, I was thinking maybe Lola. I just it's the person I've talked to the least so far. You think Lola? Yeah, but if you would rather go for the other I um, honestly wouldn't mind because I know she I know Liv is Liv is more someone who I talked to more than Lil, to be honest. Yeah, yeah we're kind of feeling I'm the fine same with way. Keeping Liv around. Because I'm start like Lola, she didn't give much. I nothing respect nothing nothing bad about her, but I think she just didn't talk much game and yeah. Liv has been Liv has been more open with us. I don't feel like it's detrimental to the team to have to vote them out and somebody does have to go. And personally, I've just made better connections with the rest of the people here. And I feel horrible having to like, you know, blindside him. But at the same time, you can't tell somebody when you're gonna vote them out. I mean, you can, that's probably not a great idea, but it still doesn't make me feel less like a bad person, <laughs> if that makes sense. I don't know, I always have to remember that this is a game and I always feel bad having to make bad decisions, but I almost wish that he was an asshole so that it was like an easier decision to make. So the plan that me and uh, Nadia came up with was to tell Robster that it's Lola and then I think we're gonna go for Robster just out of the fear of that idol. Mm -hmm. And honestly, in the past like hour, I think I've talked to the two girls more than I've talked to Robster this entire time. Oh, definitely a hundred percent. Like he he only sits in main call. That's all he does. He doesn't yeah. whisper or nothing. So no, I definitely think like I think me, you and Nadia are definitely the closest. Yeah. She was like she was like OG. You're you're not flipping on me, right? I was like, No, I swear to god I'm not flipping on you. So Exactly. My plan is ex is executing it's it's unfolding in front of, the, in front of the faces, for all y'all faces. I told y'all, we gotta have some fun in this game. I'm not trying to stick five person strong all the way to final five. Like it's just corny, bro. If she's playing me, you know, good job. Oh, I, I think if she could even play you. We're fine. I got both the girls on board for Rob. Okay, good. I think she's in there right now telling them the same thing that yeah. we were telling them. So I think we're hopefully chilling. All right, so I think the plan is to go for Robster here. Uh, love him to death, he's awesome. But I feel like we ha we need to have some fun. I can't wait to have some fun. There's like a 10% chance that I'm getting played right now, but I don't have any other options. It's it's either a 5 to 1 roster or something is going terribly wrong and my game is sunk. 
but I'm excited to go to Tribal. I can't wait. What's, what are you guys thinking here? Well, what are you thinking? You came from that call. You're right. Uh, so I think the plan right now is Robster. Um, we, we also may have mentioned that when me and Nadia. Me and Jake were just kind of telling him that he's like, yeah, you're fine. You're, you're chilling. Well, who does he think it is? We we told um, him that it was going to be you because he was like, yeah, I think Lola is like the, not a very good communicator. So I've been out here now for almost two weeks, like I think somewhere around that time. And basically, you know, I haven't been eating that well. Like my stomach is in knots. I pretty much have diarrhea every other like two hours. And then I just got the news that apparently I'm a decoy vote, which is definitely not helping. Like, I'm literally gonna throw up, like this water is gonna turn green because, what do you mean I'm a decoy vote? Like, what? Why not live at least? Like, if one of us is gonna be a decoy vote, I mean, hello, like, it's not me. Like, I'm just, I'm so disgusted, sick to my stomach. I feel nauseous. Like, I feel like I wouldn't, I don't know. I'm just like, spiraling out of control like my head is in like a tailspin like a tornado I just I can't even breathe right now I talked to Nadia and Drew but they weren't really like they were just kind of like oh like who do you want to vote like you know not really mm -hmm. saying much so I'm kind of feeling like oh is it just four against two like you know is it just going to be one of me or live like I feel like no one's being honest with me um I'm going to be completely honest this is my first time going to tribal council so yeah this is like a first experience for me so mm -hmm. yeah i mean what does that have just, to do with what i just said uh i don't know i hate to see her go like this but i hate lying to her but unfortunately this is the game if you never experienced playing minecraft survivor like this then you need to understand this it's you can't some point later down the line you've got to start turning on allies and i hate doing this to her is it gonna be me no it's not you so it's Liv. Mm -hmm. You're kidding. I cannot vote Liv. Okay. Like, she's like a sister to me. Right. So... Like, are you there? What? You just went all quiet. My mind, my mind's still wrapping through. You're disturbing me greatly right now. I'm not. You are. You're very disturbing. How am I disturbing? Hold on. How am I, how am I disturbing? This is disturbing. Like, I joined, I asked you to talk very politely, and you're, like, basically just saying it's live or me. You're giving me nothing. I wanted to work with you. I know. Like, a lot of people always say, go with your gut and, like, that just really holds true for me because day one i got on that marooning and i voted for robster to go like home or whatever and i just knew i was right i knew there was something off about this man because he's a big liar like we're having this whole conversation right now and he's just completely lying to me every time i'm i keep asking him you know what should i do like who do you think we should vote for and he's just talk to nadia talk to nadia talk to drew talking to you like like what what is even happening right now i'm so like i feel like i'm gonna pass out from this conversation he's just like silent just staring at me i'm like take a good look because this is the last person you're gonna see on this island because you're out tonight i'm done with robster like what is the matter with him like i seriously i have no words i'm just my mind's still rapping about that one vote from the earlier time about what vote i don't know the first impressions vote <laughs> Oh, so you're holding that against me. You said that it wasn't a big deal. I just don't know what it was at the time. Okay. I already explained it. I, literally, as soon as we got here, I said, I'm sorry. Like, I voted. I was honest. And you were like, oh, I appreciate the honesty. Was the honesty not appreciated? No, I do. I do honestly respect that. But for me, I don't know if that was personal. Why would it be personal? I never met you. Like, we just got off the boat. I know. But you just said you didn't know. Listen, I'm just going to go with what my gut's telling me. Well, what's your gut telling you? You haven't even told me about 
Like, hello? My mind is wrapped right now. I know Lola really wants to stay. I get that. But for me, I don't know if this is like personal for me. I'm still wrapping my mind about that one vote. I get it. She was apologizing. I understand that. I respect it. But I don't know if this was a personal move. I get it's like first impressions or everything. But still, it's hard. I still want to keep original four strong. But I don't know if I can trust Lola at this point. Thanks for fucking nothing. What the hell was that? Like, are you serious? That was the most bullshit thing ever. Where the hell is Nadia? Are you here, Nadia? Yeah. Girl. What's up? That was the most horrible conversation I ever had. Why? <laughs> that was so awkward. I just feel terrible. Like, Robert basically gave me nothing. That was like the most awkward five minutes of my life. Like, he just... I was asking him, like, so what's the vote? Like, what are we doing? Like, what do you want to do? He's like, ah, you should just talk to other people. Like, what? What the hell is that? I just can't. I cannot. This is horrible. But everyone said they're voting robbers, so I hope they stick to their word. So what's going on? Because we've heard that y'all are like, I'm strong, like, let's vote out one of us. And it's like, is that what Jake said to you guys? Well, he said that he would be down to vote Robert. I also, okay, for the record, me and Drew just talked and we were also down to vote Robert. Okay, oh, for real. So we're all on the same page. So what was yes, the confusion? Yes, and we told Robert that we were voting Lola, so. Okay. Oh, so, okay. No, it was nothing against you, dude. We had him, <laughs> we just had to pick one. Okay, that's great. So obviously we have the OG Arondu tribe who we kind of like agreed on sticking with. And as much as like, that sounds like a great idea because you know, their strength in numbers. I really like Oliver Rondu and I kind of like the girls better. And I've kind of positioned myself in like this little like middle zone between like the guys all think that I'm voting with them, the girls all think that I'm voting with them. And like, that's a good spot to be in for now. And I'd like to stay that way. But obviously like with upcoming votes and stuff, um, like you never know how long that's gonna last. And also like, if anybody, I don't know, swings some other way and somebody else is kind of in the middle, like this could go like horribly wrong. I'm like us girls gotta stick together. We're like the only three in the game. Like it'll... I agree. Shay yeah. just got voted out. That's kind of like discouraging. Yeah. Like I was really hoping to play yeah, with Shay. Shay it's gonna um, last the merge. But yeah, I definitely no, have I'm... you guys back. I hope you're not lying to us, Nadia girl. I'm not, yeah, no, I'm I promise. Cool. If you like, have one vote down. on you, it's gonna be Robert, I promise. Okay, mm -hmm. cause like, Just I would have been down to vote, or to like, have y'all's backs like, throughout the game type shit. Cause like, you know, we gotta have a woman winner, for real. Like, no, I'm down with that. I fuck with you guys. Especially because like, like, like a lot of, some of those guys in like, the other tribe especially are like, really fucking good at the game. So, I've been hearing from literally everyone that the vote is on Rob, sir, which honestly, whatever. I've had some conversations with him. He's definitely something. Um, but, you know, I just think at the same time, they were all in a tribe together. And it's kind of just me and Lola here, like, fighting for our lives. So I'm really hoping that they actually stick with that, because if not, and if I feel like it's not going that way, like if I get weird vibes, I might end up playing my fucking idol, which would be something to play it this early in the game, but honestly, like, I just really don't want to go. Well, welcome, Poka2, to Tell's Next Tribal Council. So, Nadia. This is my first time seeing you here. How does it feel to come, come to travel for the first time? I'd rather not have seen this place at all, but you know, you gotta do what you gotta do, I guess. We lost our first challenge. Lola, you on the other hand have been to now, now multiple tribal councils. How does that make you feel? Are you like getting tired and anxious and annoyed with it? Or are you just like ready to get this over with and just knock it out and, and move forward in the game? Definitely the first one. I'm very anxious. I'm very nervous. After some of the conversations today at camp, I actually feel horrible. Liv, hearing that uh, Lola feels horrible and y'all two came from the original tribe together and y'all are clearly outnumbered, how does that make you feel? 
Yeah, no, it's definitely been stressful over here. I feel that there is somewhat of a divide. I mean, it's not too, like, line in the sand type of thing, but it's definitely been stressful trying to communicate with the people of the former um, Arandu tribe. Robster, building off of that, would you agree that it's kind of, you know, tribe line based and that y'all four are together and that Liv and Lola are on the outs, or is it a lot more complex than people may think? It's a lot of things when you think about coming here, because for me, it's my first time attending Tribal Council, which I did not want to be here, but unfortunately, things have to happen. So for me, personally, I really don't know where the lines is going to go. I mean, that's bullshit. All right. Jay. I'm sorry. Like, I spoke to Robert, and I spoke to Jay, and you guys gave me nothing. Like, when I talk to you guys, it's like you were just like mm, talk to talk around see what people are saying how is that a good ally what am i supposed to do with that when you guys are just like talk around i'm trying to be your ally like you know what i mean all this vague like i don't know i don't know like that's not a good ally i feel like everyone's just quiet now like i don't know it's frustrating Jake, how do you feel hearing that? I mean, your name just got brought up alongside Robster. Do you need to say in response to Lola? I I got nothing really to say. You know, I think. Yeah, uh, you never do. The vote is clear tonight, and I'll let my vote speak for itself. All right, and lastly, Drew. So it's pretty clear looking at this tribal council that uh, OG tribe lines are certainly a factor playing in people's heads, and tensions can arise when that is the case. What is uh, the most important thing for you in terms of getting through this vote? What are you looking at mainly? I am just kind of hoping that what I thought the plan was going to be goes through. Uh, it would really suck if something went wrong that, and I wasn't aware of it. So I'm just hoping for a normal tribal that doesn't blow up too much. All right. And with that, you know, I have anything else to say? What is a normal tribal? Uh, you know, where I don't get rid of that. That's the I'm ideal tribal possible. for most of us, I think. Yeah. That's the opposite of normal. Alright, well with that, it's time to vote. Jake, you're up first. One down on the Jake Express. I don't know how many to go, but we ain't stopping until I get this free hundred dollars. Goodbye. for Robert because he clearly does not know how to play Survivor. You're definitely not someone I could ever see as my ally. You're like the opposite of an ally, more like an enemy. I hate lying to you. Like, unfortunately, there's nothing I could do about it. We, we need just a little bit more fun in this game. All right, I'll go tie the votes. tallied the votes. If anybody has hidden the mini dial and like to play it, now be the time to do so. Alright, I'll read the votes. First vote. Lola. Second vote. Robster. Third vote. Robster. Fourth vote, Robster. Fifth vote. And the fourth person voted out Soccer's Minecraft Survivor, the Pantanel, Robster, who's from your torch. Uh, that's fine. 
Well, I had fun though. Robster, you're playing a great game. It was lovely to see you out here. Always love to have you play. Unfortunately though, time has come to an end and the tribe has yep. spoken. It's time for you to head out. Ah, uh, no our feelings guys. It's been an honor. Kick ass. See you later. So, see you later, out. dudes. Y'all just arrived another tribal council and one step closer to win that hundred dollars. Head back to camp. Ah, I was blindsided, and to be honest, though, I had a blast. I, d I didn't want to go out with, like, upsetness. I just went out with my head up high. I tried my best. There's nothing I can say about it. I gave my all. I have nothing but regret to myself, but I had a pleasure being back to play this game, and hopefully this is not the end of me. Hopefully I'll be back for another future season, and this has been truly an honor, and I will not forget the experience.